everyone! In this video, we're creating a new flag for the Dominican Republic. This is the current flag of the Dominican Republic. We recommend you check out our Dominican Republic flag review video. We won't reveal the score, though we can say it didn't do so well. So what are the issues with the flag? The biggest issue is the coat of arms. The coat of arms is very detailed and complicated and makes this flag very difficult to reproduce accurately. The coat of arms also means the flag has too many colors, with six in total. Another concern is the lack of clarity regarding symbolism. We'll discuss that in more detail later. With these issues in mind, we're now going to create our design. We're going to base our design on the current flag. Given the problems of the coat of arms, we're going to remove it and see what we're left with. What we have now is a white cross and a field that consists of red and blue. This design is simple and is pretty easy to replicate. So could we simply use this design? Yes, we could. With or without the coat of arms, this is a distinctive design among sovereign countries. The flag without the coat of arms would work very well as the national flag. Our one concern about the design is that it may be slightly confusing trying to remember which sections of the field are red and which are blue. Our other issue is that in this video, we want to create something original, our own flag this design. We're going to tinker slightly with the design as it currently stands. Before we reveal our effort, we want to show you the original flag of the Dominican Republic. This design didn't have the coat of arms and the upper field was blue and the lower field was red. We prefer this field layout to the current one because we think it's easier to remember where the blue and red colors are supposed to be. Taking this concept, we're going to alter the field layout in a different way. Here we have the hoist side of the field all in red, while the fly side is all in blue. And this is our completed design. Here are our thoughts on our design. We wanted to create something original while keeping the basic design intact. While the current layout without the coat of arms is an excellent design, we believe our layout is a little easier to remember. So what about symbolism? With the current flag, the symbolism of the coat of arms has a heavy religious influence. Of course, the white cross design is also a symbol of Christianity. Unfortunately, the symbolism of the red and blue has never been officially decided upon, though a number of theories exist. Some say the blue symbolizes liberty, while others say it represents the sky. The red is said to symbolize the blood of the people. Some sources claim the white of the cross represents salvation, while others claim it symbolizes peace. We're going to take most of these ideas and apply them to our flag, as well as creating some symbolism of our own. The cross symbolizes Christianity, while the white color represents peace. The upper red field recalls the bloodshed of the people, while the lower red represents the liberty that the bloodshed brought about. The upper blue field represents the sky, while the lower blue represents the Caribbean Sea, which surrounds most of the country. If we were to review the flag using the five basic principles of flag design, the flag would score very highly. The design is simple and easy to reproduce. We've applied meaningful and well-defined symbolism to the various parts of the flag. The flag has three colors, which meets the recommended maximum of three. The flag has no coat of arms or any other complicated elements. Finally, our flag is distinctive among flags of sovereign nations. The flag would receive top marks in each principle and would therefore get a perfect score of 10 out of 10. So what do you guys think? Do you prefer the current field layout to the one we created? Could we have designed a brand new flag from scratch? Let us know your thoughts. Remember to subscribe to our channel and check out our other videos. Thank you for watching.